Infinix Note 30 is here. Note 30? Parang ang laking lundag ah. Last time I checked Infinix Note 12, parang naging 30 ngayon. Malas ba ang number 13? Well, actually the real reason, the real reason kung bakit ang laki ng leap in terms of yung generation ng series is because napakalaki ng change in terms of yung spec. Sure ka ba dyan? That's right. The Infinix Note 12 G96, the predecessor of this phone, has only a 4G processor. G96 lumang-luma na ito po ay Umabot na nga na 4-digit yung kanyang processor eh. Dimensity 6080. 5G na po. Yung charging 45 watts. All-round fast charge. 5,000 milliamperes mega battery. Meron pa siyang 108MP. Master triple camera. 6.78 inch. 120Hz refresh rate display. Android 13 na. Hindi na po 11 like last time. At saka 8 gigs of RAM. 256 gigabytes of storage na pwede na mag-extend up to 16 gigabytes of RAM. May dual speakers pa at sound by JBL. Oh my God! First time to, na nangyari na mayroon mang collaboration na with JBL. Tadaan! Look at that. JBL. Malak siguro to. Actually, mayroon kong speakers sa bahay, guys. JBL. Binabayo. What? Yung mga neighbors ko. Sa akin, big deal to. Nagkita po ang JBL. Spell JBL. JBL? J-B-L Oh, uh, spell Harman Kardon Ah... Uh, eh... Oh, diba? Ang hirap? Oh. Pero yung tama na yung kalokohan, i-unbox na natin itong si Infinix Note 30 5G Apat sabihin and you're watching Unbox na yun is Uhu Now the first thing you will notice on this box is Meron po siyang cover from the one and only Mia Sa Mobile Legends Ayan yeah. This skin Nung una hindi ko alam kung ano to But this, this is the Doom Catalyst skin Collector skin po yan ni Mia A very rare skin Coming soon siguro sa ML Siguro pag binili mo tong phone to May free collector skin Kung lang alam ha Maka i-quote nyo ako ha <laughs> But yes May collaboration po si Infinix At si MPL Ayan po Infinix MPL Hindi po to yung kay Tony Fowler ha Iba po yan But yes Cover lang po to no uh, Ito po yung specs sa likod The nice thing about The Infinix Note 30 Kapag kahit wala yung cover, is napakaganda po ng kanyang box. Updated na po. Alam nyo na yan, di ba? Kapag ka, mga box before, hindi po siya ganito yung itsura. Updated na updated na po yung box ni Infinix Note 30 5G. Iba na po yung texture. Iba na po yung nakalagay. At may pa JBL pa silang logo dito. Sa ilalim, meron 45 watts all-round fast charge with the lightning logo. Box has a nice texture. Pero boss na natin na. Uy, tinan nyo na. Pag habang binubuksan, meron Infinix na lumalabas dito. There you go. And here's the phone itself. Look at that. Palupit ng palupit yung plastic sa loob. Ito pa yung likod ng phone. Ooh, shiny. Kabeta ko to. Uh, may halik ko na eh. <laughs> mahal to guys. Boss ko sa marketplace, mas mahal na yung value. May halik na ni Beans. Hinalikan ni Beans Domingo. Ito na po <laughs> yung kanyang uh, cover. And underneath, we got the screen protector. Wow. Ah, yung kasa may kasama siyang ano? Kung paano mo i-install yung screen protector, meron siyang ganun. Pati yung pangpunas. What? Guys, kala ko, akala ko yung cover lang yung collaboration. Meron pa pala silang... Oh. May pakising. Ay, hindi magkasya. siya. Tanggal, tanggalin daw kasi yung plastic. Google! Okay, so ito yung picture ng phone. Pakising. Oh. Diba? This is what you will get with this. Hindi ko alam kung ano to ha. Special edition itong... Infinix na to. Ba kasi clear casing lang yung makuha nyo sa regular na Infinix Note 30. Pero this one, if you buy the Infinix na may Mobile Legends sa harapan, most likely meron siyang ganito. Yung logo ni ano, Mobile Legends. From the sides, mga ports, and yung camera. Grabe mo yung camera na cut out ang laki. Pero may ano Guys, isa to sa mga pinakamalaking lundag. 45 watts. Si Infinix Note 12 G96, no? Ay only 33 watts. This one is 45 watts. Nice improvement. Meron pa siyang USB Type-C cable and the SIM ejector pin. Wow, med medyo malaki to ah. This is a big phone. Naging maliit yung itsura ng kamay ko with this phone. By the way, 6.78 inch based dun sa box na nakita namin. The back is gradient, no? Pag tinatama ng ilaw, nagbabag yung kulay. The color we have here is the interstellar blue. Malapad po yung phone. When you hold it, it feels like a very large device. Matte finish yung likod niya, no? Hindi po dumihin. You can actually use this without the jelly case, pero... 
on the safe side, no? Siyempre, baka ma- mahulog nyo. Magkaroon siya ng den, sayang. Gusto nyo ba ibenta to upgrade your phone. Yung camera module din, no? Napakalaki. This square area right here has four circles. One para dun sa kanyang 108 MP. Hindi ko na na-disclose yung ibang features ng camera. Basta 108 MP siya. Nakalagay dito. 108 MP. Kailangan, meron dalawang sensor dito. Iisa lang yung bilog niya. Ito yung LED flash. And lastly, ito yung black na bilog. Not sure kung what this is. A sensor lang to. We got here the not so noticeable na logo. Infinix 5G. Ayan po. Feeling ko... Ah, sir, ano po ginagawa niya, sir? Alam ko kung malamig. Cold to the touch. Kasi doon malalaman kung glass ba siya or plastic. Ano yung kaya ito eh? Ganito kasi yung logic niyan. No? Kapag tunay siya, glass talaga. Yung, yung feeling. Tunay yung... Ano. Pag hindi, hindi tunay na malamig yung feeling. Plastic. Hindi ganito tayo sa mukha. Tanga! Sa gilid natin yung chrome finish dito. This is plastic by the way. Yung kanyang body. And dito pa yung power button, volume rocker. Taas merong, huy, sound by JBL. Ito pa yung speaker nyo. And we've got one speaker and the second speaker ay nasa ilalim. Together with the USB Type-C port, microphone, and the head phone jack. Hi-res audio pala yan. And sa left side is yung kanyang SIM tray na merong dual nano SIM card slot plus micro SD card slot for expandability on top of the base variant nyo guys is 128GB na. Good news, dalawang variants na yung kanila available. Merong 128 at merong pang 256GB. Maliit lang po yung difference daw ng kanilang presyo. Coming soon po yan. Hindi, wow. Okay, so let's open the phone and look at this. Ang unang bubungad sa inyo ay yung wallpaper ni Mia. Mukhang, ah hindi, yung wallpaper lang. So, kala ko pa yung icons, pati yung mga sound effects ay uh, Mobile Legends din, no? Gusto kasi may ringtone na pagbubuksan mo yung phone, Welcome to Mobile Legends. Kaya lang nakakainis na the open. Well, 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 welcome to Mobile Legends. Ito po ay Android 13 na. Actually, matangkad ang display. The bezels are not too thin. And smooth siya tingnan. Look at this. 120 hertz refresh rate po yan. Yan ako sa video ah. Maganda ang kanyang video. And the sounds. Wow! Ah, ang sharp tingnan ng display, already quite impressive for Infinix, no? Kasi nag-start si Infinix, alam kong ano yung itsura ng mga display nila. It was dim, the color was not there, it lacked sharpness, wala sa details and things like that. But, nag-evolve na si Infinix since nung Note 12, and it has carried over some really good, ito na lang Note 30. So, hindi lang yung video yung nag-upgrade ngayon, but also pati yung sound, mas immersive na dahil dual speakers tapos JBL pa. Malakas, malakas. I like this. Yun nga lang, malaki yung kanyang punch hole. Ayan po, punch hole. So, kapag nag-zoom in ka, just like that, pinch to zoom, itang kita yung bilog dun sa gilid. Pero okay na to kasi, kadalas kasi sa mga itong presyohan, puro water drop notch eh. Na performance, hindi ko pwede yung ipakita yung Antutu benchmark. Yun yung mga gameplay, bawal pa. Alam ko yung inintay nyo. Kasi sobrang naka-excite. Four digit na yung dimensity. 5G na po siya. Pero in my full review na po yun, ito ay unboxing and first impressions pa lang. Ipakita ko na sa inyo yung mga pictures na nakuha ko dito. Wow! Pwede na! Nice na yung mga photos niya na ah, Infinix ha. Ah. Amazing HDR here and uh, background blur, napakaganda. The portraits, amazing. Pero it's got that contrast, no? When it comes to yung mga flowers and subjects, ang ganda. Ito may mga sample na selfie ni Beng. Yan po, yan po yung model namin si Beng. Ito may mga sample ng portrait shots ni Beng. Even sa indoors, okay pa rin siya. Pero best talaga to sa outdoors, ha? Napansin namin na ganda na dynamic range. It's able to control the lighting. Marami ka makita sa shadowy parts. And, tinan mo yan. That was taken from this phone. Look at the details. Ganda, di ba? So, all will be revealed in time. In our full review, gameplay, Antutu benchmark, and other things that you need to, to know about this phone. So, if you want to buy this phone, let me know guys in the comments below. And we will include it in our full review. Phoenix Note 30, it will launch NASA May 30. Right now, this is actually the most exciting phone to buy this year. Like, the hype is so ta. Same height ba ng hype ni Redmi Note 12? Maybe. Could this be much more solid than Redmi Note 12? We will find out soon. Okay, mag subscribe ka na. Hit the bell icon so that you don't miss any of my great content. This is Vince and you're watching Unbox Series. Hoo-hoo.